and every one of you today. Amen. Being in the household of God on today. Amen. Amen. I give him praise on today. Yes. Yes. Amen. Because of who he is. Yes. Yes. Amen. We can give him glory on this resurrection Amen. Sunday. Yes. Amen. We don't know what next Sunday gonna get you or what we gonna get you or not. So we're going to give God glory today because he deserves the highest praise. Have we got anybody want to praise him on the I ain't talking about just a little pat of your hand, but do you really love the Lord? When you were down and out, who picked you up? Hallelujah, when you didn't have no food in the fridge today. And old folks use it up. Who put something in there for you? Won't nobody but Jesus. Yeah, right. When you ain't have no money, the gym in the pocket. Come on, Jimmy. Ain't paid the time, but God still made the way for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, somebody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you got that loan up off, who picked you up? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on, yeah. Come on. Yeah. Won't nobody but the Lord. Nobody. What can I go a little bit for? When you was out there home on you. Strong out. Amen. Want the love every man and woman that you can come in contact with. Who delivered you? Nobody but the Lord. That's why we ought to be sold out today. We ain't coming to pen and pat today. We ought to be sold out. For him. On the day. We ain't pointing no fingers. I'm pointing at me. This word gonna hit all of us today. Hallelujah. 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 I'm just gonna read two verses because you have already heard the word in your hearing, John 11 through verse 18. But I want to bring my message from these two verses. Verse 16. Amen. Amen. Verse 15 and 16. Amen. I'm reading out the King James Version of the Bible. Jesus said unto her, Woman, why weepest thou? Whom seekest thou? She supposing him to be a gardener said unto him, Sir, if thou have borne him hence, tell me where thou hast laid him, and I will take him away. Amen. She was sold out for the Lord. Amen. And Jesus said unto her, Mary, Mary. Mm -hmm. you may be seated. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It said, Jesus said unto her, Mary. Mary. It said, and Jesus yes. said unto her, mm -hmm. Mary. Mary. Yes. You can look at that word saying, Jesus said unto Elma, Elma. Huh. Come on, somebody. You can look at that word and it said, Jesus said unto Sister Stacy, yes. Stacy. Yes. See, Jesus won't get us mixed up with nobody. Amen. We come today, amen, to look at this word, praise God, talking about, amen, if I was to use a message title today, it was an encounter with Jesus. Yeah. An encounter with Jesus. Praise God, you see, every day of our life, even if it's not Easter Sunday or Resurrection Sunday, we have an encounter with somebody. We have an encounter with something. Praise God, it's not always good that we have encounters with. We have encounters with people at the grocery store. We have encounters with people on our job. Praise God, we have encounters with strangers. We have encounters with each other. So I thank God for each and every one of you. I do preach in the name of my Lord. I thank all the ministers. Amen. For being in your rightful place. All the deacons, deaconess. Thank you for the ushers. Thank God for my husband. Amen. Thank God for you and you. Amen. But all of us have encounters. Yes. But the most insignificant encounter is with Jesus the Christ. Amen. All the rest of them don't matter. Amen. 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 Solomon tells us that they are vanity. Meaning that they're going to waste away. 
But Mary, the one, amen, if you look in John 11, praise God, she was the one that anointed Jesus for his burial. Uh, have I got anybody in here? Uh, chapter 12, amen. Uh, amen, Jesus was over there. Uh, amen, amen, having dinner. Uh, amen, at Lazarus' house. Uh, amen, they were all sitting around the table. Uh, amen, if you know how they did in the back days. Uh, amen, they said that, amen, their head would be down this way. Uh, and the feet were back the other way. Uh, here come this woman in. Amen. That had so much sin in her before Jesus delivered her. Come on, somebody. We have had sin in us before Jesus delivered us. Maybe just I had sin. Come on, man. Amen. Come on, Amen. But Mary had never forgotten what Jesus done for her. Amen. Sometimes, amen, we'll forget what Jesus done for us. I don't care how old you are today or how young we all going to have an encounter with Jesus the Christ. Mary began to come in, amen, where women won't permit it. All right, it was only men that sit around the table. Uh, praise God, Martha was in doing the work that she needed to do. Uh, she even went to Jesus and told Jesus, uh, Mary ain't helping me do nothing. Yeah. <laughs> ain't you had some people that you had heard and you said that they ain't helping do nothing. I need some help. Yeah. But praise God, Jesus told her, look, Mary, Martha, Mary have told the best part. Because she wants to sit at my feet. She wants to get the teaching that she needs. Because I got everything, praise God, that she needs. And she understands that. Mary had something that the Sanhedrin court couldn't take out for her. Yeah. All right. Mary had sin in her. Yeah. Praise God. They had, the sin he just couldn't take it off of. They had sin in them. Yeah. The Bible say, be careful how you lay hands. Yeah. Come on, somebody. But yeah. Jesus allowed Mary to come in. Praise God to the place that she won't welcome. Right they began to look at her uh, like she was nobody, uh, like they do the women today. Uh, when you're trying to do the best you can, uh, they'll look at you. Uh, but sometimes you just got to walk through uh, and just say, excuse me, uh, excuse me, uh, excuse me. Uh, excuse me uh, but I'm going to see Jesus. Uh, I'm going to have an encounter with him. Excuse me. Uh, I'm going all the way up to the front. Uh, Come out in him. Amen. No, she ain't supposed to be in that him. They got the audacity to say, excuse me. Come on, somebody. Mary was the one of verse 3 of chapter 12. It said, Mary took a pound of ointment, a spaniel, very costly, and anointed Jesus' feet and wiped his feet with her hair, and the house was filled with their own. I don't know about you, but every once in a while, somebody will come in with a good smell of perfume. Amen. That aroma will fill up the house. Have I got anybody here that won't try to impress nobody, but it just had a job to do? Mary had a job to do. Uh, amen. Jesus had somebody uh, that he could count on. Uh, and don't listen to them men uh, that out there tell you women they supposed to preach. Uh, yeah. Amen. Jesus pulled Mary uh, all the way from the back. Uh, yeah. Glory be to God. Uh, all the way up to the front uh, because she understood. Uh, praise God that encounter that she had with him was an everlasting can I hear anybody say amen? amen. Then one of the disciples, Judas Iscariot, old rogue and old still, in the midst, Simon's son, when she betrayed Jesus, it said him, why not this fourth man sold for 300 pence? Why you put that on Jesus? He don't need nothing. We need amen so we can have this money. To give to the poor. Yeah. Jesus won't study no poor. Thank uh -huh. you. Jesus would think about putting that money in his pocket. Jesus already know he was a rogue. Right. He already know he stole from him. Yeah. Don't you know Jesus know what's in your pocketbook? Yeah. 
I'm going to give him this little bit. Because he's right going to give him that little bit. Hallelujah. See where that little bit going to take you to. Yeah. 
But you only gonna have an everlasting comfort and comfort, amen, in Jesus the Christ. Yes. Who is the head of our life? Yes. It's a meeting experience. It's like no other experience. All these pagan holidays talk about Easter egg hunt. Amen. And more churches than ever have signed up to have Easter egg hunt. I don't see nowhere in the Bible. He said one time and they ain't never rolled no egg. <laughs> never said a, a, a funny laid egg. And the churches are loaded up with children. On Saturday. Come on now. Come on. On Friday. Come on, come on. Well, come Sunday, where they at? Praise God they didn't have an encounter. Because when you do things right according to the word, Jesus. it will draw people in. Jesus. Yes, yes. Not to come eat up your food and go on by their wow. Amen. You see, we are the latter day church, so we got to do things the right way. Amen. Amen. No he said hunk in here. No he said basket up in here, up in here. Amen. All we're gonna do is give God the glory. Amen. Because we had a special Amen. encounter with him. Where the children, they got the house up. Uh, well, if you want them to have something, have a Sunday program. Yeah. Amen. Where well, they can give some glory to God. Uh, have some program, praise God. Amen. Where well, they can lift them up. Uh, yeah. Have some program where well, they can write some poems uh, yeah. and love letters to Jesus. Yeah. Amen. Where well, you don't need no eggs. Yeah. Amen. They go ask for fertility back then. Amen. We don't need that because we have everything. The Lord has for us. Amen. Where you are right now is where God got you here. Amen. Come on, somebody. Come on, yeah. I know Come many on. people have yeah. experience and kind of you thinking that you got there all by yourself. Come on now. Come on, come on, come on. But I want you to know oh. today we didn't get here on our own. Okay, how big a big shot you are. If you're a little roller, it's okay. Everybody moving by the power. Oh he began to talk to Mary. And Mary and her sisters and friends had went down to the sepulchre early in the morning. Uh, amen. See, I tell everybody, get up early in the morning. Uh, if you want to have an experience with Jesus, get up early in the morning. Uh, if you want to have an encounter with him, get up for the sun so it's shining. Uh, and begin to tell God, God, I love you. God, I thank you. I thank you for being who you are. I thank you for the encounter I had. I thank you for healing me and delivering me. Uh, in the name yeah. of Jesus, I yeah. thank you for keeping my family. Yes, yes. 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 But we didn't think they could be killed. Amen. Glory. He went on. This Mary and the other Marys and their friends went down to the sepulchre early in the morning. The first day of the week. Come on, somebody. Ain't today the first day of the week? Come on, somebody. That's when the calendar began to change. When Jesus got up out that grave on the third day, he said, I'm getting ready to do something different. I'm going to shift time like never been shipped today. Come on, somebody. I'm going to let this woman that has been redeemed, I'm going to let this woman that has been saved, sanctified, Amen. Amen. And had an encounter with me. Yeah. Yeah, she never forgot. Come on, Jesus. So he allowed them to come early in the morning. It said that was in the dark. Early in the morning. Come on, somebody. But he still let them come. Because they were looking for Jesus to still be dead. They hadn't got the full effect of who he was. Come on, somebody. Sometimes we don't get the full effect of what God is trying to tell us. The full effect of having an encounter with him. But we so sanctified. Come on, somebody. She began to come down to the sepulchre and they saw the stone rolled away. Yes. The yes. stone was big. Yes. Glory yes. be to God. I don't know how many men. Amen. It took to roll the stone up. Yes. They told Pilate, we got to roll the stone. 
on to them. We got to keep them in because we don't know. They might say that he, they stole his body. So we roll the stone up here. And King, let us get your signature on there. They just stick your hand in this ring. So when everybody see, they know not to roll this stone. But they had had an encounter with Jesus. Amen. You said Jesus got people and the angels lost all around. And he had signed two. And this one scripture say one, another say two. Two is teamwork. Teamwork make the dream work. Come on, somebody. And they had taken the Lord away. Peter, therefore, went forth and the disciples, amen, and the other disciples, which were John, and they came to the sepulchre. So they ran together. But the young one outran the old one. Can I say that again? So the young one outran the old one. Stop acting like you're 16. Come on, somebody. Put your dress up to here. Come on, somebody. You can hear the Bible told us to dress modestly. I can't draw nobody if I got on what you got on. I want to be dressed with the anointing of God from head to toe. Amen. Then the Bible said us old ones. Did I say old ones? Let me hear something. Come on, somebody. Old ones, nigga. Young ones. How to take care of the hook? How to take care of the tree? How to take care of the hole? That's right. That's right. If you have an account with him, I told you the world don't want to hear this. Unless they submit themselves under the authority of Jesus. But I want to tell you today, Mary had an unrecognized encounter with Jesus. She had an encounter so much with him, she was able to weigh all the problems of life. Many places women are not even recognized. They try to step over you. But I'm so glad that the Lord we serve. Yes. Come on, somebody. Yes. He's able to do it seemingly. Yes. Abundantly more than you can think. Yes. If God opened the door, you better be available yes. and willing to walk yes. on that door. Yes. She wasn't scared. And as we as Christians ought not to be scared. Come on, somebody. Yeah, yeah. Have you ever seen so many scared Christians? Amen. Come on now. Huh? Come on. Yeah. They looking. Come on. For this good moon to come. Come on. Come on, somebody. They wondering. They got the glass and red to see what the moon gonna do. The king is saying, I tell you, the time is not yet near. I tell you, you want to know when I'm coming. I'm going to be just like Jonah was. Three nights in the well of the bed. Of the, oh, the well. You look at what's up to be in the sun. And in the moon, he ain't in. You look at what he brought to the prophesy to you a lie. He let them live. Come on. But you got to have an experience. Come on. With Christ Jesus. Get it out. Get it out. Get it out. Nobody. Right. Right. Amen. For what he did for me, Amen. he had to do something different to you. Yeah. 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 Let yeah. me tell you about me. He yeah. had to bring me way up. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. you might just been on the surface. Yeah. 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 But he had to pull, pull me up out of the mighty pit. Come on, yeah. Come on somebody. Yeah. But I became so yeah. I had to get on my knees. And I was staying down there so long. That all the circulation uh, would be out of my knees. Yeah. I couldn't hardly stand up uh, because I wanted to be sold out for him. Yeah. I want him to use me for his glory. The devil yeah. had a field day with me. Oh, he had a field day with you. 
with you. Mary had a field day too when she was in sin. She couldn't get free. But thanks be to God that had an encounter with her that she would never forget. And I tell you, wherever your experience was, don't forget where Jesus brought you from. Come on, somebody. And down this Mary, huh? She out there in the summer. Amen, amen. They have brought this oil uh, to anoint Jesus' body uh, one more time. Uh, she's already anointed. Uh, God let her anoint it uh, when she left Lazarus' house uh, because he knew that by the time she got to the sepulchre, he won't going to be there. Uh, so, Mary, you already done your job. Uh, can somebody say glory? Uh, hallelujah. Uh, but she brought all her friends with her. Uh, See what God has done. Amen. And then Jesus asked her, Mary, why are you weeping? Why are you weeping so hard? Why did you think I was going to leave you when I told you? On the third day, I was going to rise up. Did you forget? Most of us have forgotten. What God told us. Come on. Come on. We don't remember when we first had an encounter with God. We don't remember what He did for us because it's been so long ago. Well, it won't that long ago when you were doing what you wanted to do. Come on. How I say that because you ain't been saved all your life. All right. Because it's just a click back. But God. Have redeemed us. Yes. He said, Who seekers I? Now, who are you looking for in this great man? Uh -huh. If I could just speak in this plain English. Oh, yeah. Amen. Who are you looking for here? All right. mm. I already told y'all. Ain't nothing changed. Amen. My God. But Mary, being a woman of grief and blind from the situation, could see him because she didn't expect to see him. Let me come park right there with you. You expect to see God moving in your life. You won't still be the same. I don't care what the doctor said. The doctor tried to pronounce me with lupus about 30 years ago. I went to the dermatologist. They drew blood. And before I could get back to work, he tells them to tell me to come on back. You got lupus. You need to come back now. They gave me the word. I said, I ain't going back. He ain't talking to me. Right. He got my record mixed up with somebody else. When you have started yourself with the devil, put on you. He said, he healing this. He said his word. And he healing this. You got to work the word in your life. Amen. 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 Mary was blind by the situation. Amen. She didn't understand who was talking to her. Amen. Sometimes God will blind us. Amen. Until we start. Amen. Hear him. She supposed him being a gardener. Somebody kept the ground. And she said, sir, if thou have born him, if you know where he is, just, just tell me. That's all you got to do. Is just tell me where he is. And I'll go get him. How's she going to take a big man like Jesus? Come on, somebody. But she felt that she could do it. When you feel like, praise God, you can do it. You can lift up anybody. Yeah. If your child has been run over by a car, and ain't no help there, you feel like, praise God, you can lift that car up out of you. Then you'll wait till nobody get there. Do it. Come on, somebody. Lord. You God will give you that strength like an eagle. Hallelujah. He said, tell me. She tells him, tell me where you laid him, and I will take him away. And Jesus, this is going to take my text from. Amen. Said unto her, Mary. Mary. Now, you know, when your mother and your father called you, Mm -hmm. You got a good relationship. Come on. It just rings. Mm -hmm. But 
when you do something you ain't got no business doing. Well, Read! Right. Yeah. Yeah. A gal! Yeah. They're calling you. You're going to know the difference in the call. Right. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Y'all done had all girls calling you. And you know when they meant business. Right. And she said under him, Amen. she turned herself. Amen. Oh, my God. She turned herself. That means the way she was going, she had to turn around. Amen. And when she turned around, she saw Jesus. And said unto him, because she recognized his voice, and she said to him, Rabboni, which means teacher, what is to say, master? She got excited because she recognized Jesus' voice. He said, my sheep know my voice and a stranger. Jesus. They will not follow. Say what now? They will not follow. They will not follow. Keep on following this world. Keep on following the news. Keep on following all these distractions on TV. Sometimes you just got to shut everything down and get in your word and say what Jesus said. Because the news, most of these prophets ain't doing them a proper line. They're not telling you how to get saved, how to get sanctified, how to live holy for the Lord. Not about how to get well. Oh. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Not about you can have this and have yeah. that. All you got to do is speak it. Amen. I mean, you're going to have to do more than speak it. Yeah. You have to put some action to this thing. Come on, somebody. Amen. You're going to have to be sold out. Amen. If this seems that we're in a favor, you're going to have to be sold out for him. Come on, somebody. You're going to have to give your all. I'm going to have to give my all. If I want favor. See, favor. Can I just tell you about favor? I'm about to go to my seat. Favor will allow you to get stuff that you don't need deserve. Y'all no credit can be messed up on the floor. Y'all know I ain't mean got good credit. I don't care whether you're the preacher, the teacher, the lawyer. Come on, somebody. The lawyers got the best, one of, one of the worst credit records ever. Amen. The lawyers and the doctors. All right, now. Y'all be playing nothing but getting your money. But when you got the favor of God, Come on. Come on. you just walk in the place. Come on, somebody. You don't know what God Amen. But God just told you to show up over there. Come on, somebody. God just told you to show up over there. Walk in, huh? Amen. Walk in, okay. Here comes the woman or man of God. Oh, yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Right. He ain't never been to a car lot. Yeah. And the man said, I got just what you need. Amen. Every car I've had in the last 20 years, I didn't pick it up. Amen. God picked them up. Amen. Sometimes they brought them from the back. Amen. But they were brand new. Amen. Amen. And they say, God, I said, God, you were awesome. That's right. Yeah. You're wonderful. Yes, yes. You're marvelous. Yes, yes. If you just sing it, I don't care what people say about you. Yeah. Sing God. Yeah. Yeah. Sing his favor. Mary's favor was with God. Yes. She never forgot yeah. her first encounter with him. My God. And my advice to you, I beseech you, brother, by the mercies of God. That you present your body a living sacrifice, a holy and self unto God, which is your reasonable. God ain't gonna ask you for too much. He ain't gonna ask you more than you can bear because when your strength is weak, he is strong in you. This season of hope that we're in, this life after death, you got to get a second chance. A second wind. Uh, come on, somebody. There's that kills, uh, who was a tax collector. Uh, amen. Uh, hated by everybody. Uh, find uh, over in Luke 19. Uh, come on, somebody. Uh, he was up in that sycamore tree. Uh, a little short man uh, had an encounter with God. Uh, can I hear somebody say, uh, I just had an encounter. Uh, amen. Jack Hill got way up uh, in the tree. Uh, a little short man. How uh, uh, he got up there uh, by the help of God. Uh, he had a willing mind. 
mind. He was able. And he knew God was able. So he got up high. And when Jesus got up under that sycamore tree, he said, kill. Don't he know your name? Come down. Come down. I'm going and buying at your house. Let me eat dinner with you, boy. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what you got on the menu. But I'm going to your house today. The exact kids invite all his buddies. Ain't that wonderful? Come on, somebody. All you got to do is be a yielding vessel. What the yielding mean? Available. I give my life. You got me sold out. Yes. Keep finding these root dogs. Uh -oh. hmm? Get that rabbit foot in your pocket. Uh -oh. Many houses you go to got a horseshoe or hole. Uh -huh. What's that going to do? That thing is dead. <laughs> we should have a living. Amen. 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 So she had an encounter with him. Amen. She wanted to reach out and just touch him and hold on to him because she knew now that that was her Messiah. Yes. My God. Yes, yes. But he said, Mary, uh, see, Jesus had to fulfill the whole thing. Uh -huh. yeah. He said, Mary, don't touch me now. Don't touch me. I ain't ascending yet. I got to ascend to my father. Because that's the final stage. Yeah. And then I, I'll be right, Mary. Hold it right there. Oh, I'll be right yeah. back. Yeah. Yeah. But what I want you to do I want you to go down and tell them more that I'm hanging with. Yeah. My disciples that live with them. Uh, or go tell them, uh, amen, that she has seen Jesus. Uh, come on, somebody. Yeah. And she spoke the things unto her that her and Jesus had talked about. Yeah. Yeah. Look, you can talk to you and look at the face. Mm -hmm. That ain't going to believe you. No. Amen. Because they didn't have that account. Amen. 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 You remember, dude? Come on, somebody. Amen. He didn't believe. No. He said, "Less I see the prince in his hand, the nails in his feet. Glory. Come on, somebody. Where they pierce him in the side, where Amen. I can stretch my hand through. I ain't gonna believe in him." But Jesus had went to heaven and got that glorified body. And when they were shut up in the house, he come through the doors. A regular man could Amen. come through the door unless he opened the door. But Amen. Jesus comes through the door. Come on, Jesus. He didn't need no door because he is the door. Yeah. And I'm right. telling you today. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Get an encounter with the one that bled, suffered, and died for you. The one that rose up on the third day morning. Yes. Might not have been this Sunday morning. Yeah. But praise yeah. God, we recognize oh. him for doing what he did. Yeah. Yeah. We give him glory. Yeah. For all that he done, we thank him. They thought about that thing for a little while. And they say, Jesus, when he come through, he said, peace be unto you. Amen. When Jesus come into your life, I'm closing with them. You will have peace. Praise God that surpasses all understanding. Amen. Because you have had an encounter with Jesus. Amen. He said, I'll give you peace. And if I don't have enough peace, I can go to my father with Sydney. Even so, I do. And if I have that peace, you can have it too. He said, receive. He breathed on them. And I said, Receive ye the Holy Ghost. Yes. And whosoever say ever sin ye remit are remitted unto them. Amen. And whosoever sins are retained, Amen. they are retained. They are retained. Amen. That means that if you forgive them, I am forgiven. Amen. If you don't forgive them, I ain't need uh -huh. I take you. For what you are saying. Right. Because I gave you truth. Mm -hmm. You know. And I know. And believe. Mm -hmm. Praise God. On the third day. Yes. After being in that ground. Yes. On Jewish time. Yes. He rose. He rose. Glory. He rose. He rose. Thank you, Father. Christ Jesus lives today. Yes. 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 He walks yes. with me. Yes. He talks with me. And carry me along the way. Yes. He lives. He lives in me. He lives in you. Yes. Yes. 
Go tell somebody today the, the good news. Amen. Jesus rose up. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. He rose up for you. You might not be saved yet. But this is a great opportunity Amen. for you to get saved. Amen. This is a great opportunity for you to give all that you have back to him. Amen. This is a great opportunity that you offer yourself down Glory. so you can have a real encounter with Amen. Jesus. Amen. They had everything they needed, Amen. but they forgot that Jesus told them, I'll be right back. Oh, Thomas, that doubt one. Mm -hmm. Said, I ain't studying what you talking about. Y'all yeah. over here talking noise. Uh, That's what they tell you to do. You talking noise. I don't want to hear that. I don't want to hear it. Uh, but except I see the hands, his right hands, now. the print of his nails, and his finger to the prints of his nails, and thrust my hand in his side, in his side. I will not believe. Come on, somebody. Mm -hmm. Jesus. Came to Thomas and come, the door was shut. And he stood in the midst and said, Peace be on you. Then said he to Thomas, Reach hither my fingers and behold my hand. And reach hither thy hand and thrust it into my side. And I be and be not faithless. Come on. But believe. But believe. Only believe. Believe. When you have an encounter with Jesus, mm -hmm. you can believe. Yes, Amen. You can take it to the front. Right. Thank you, Father. Yeah. Man, get ready to close. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you can take it to the bank. Yeah, yeah. Of Jesus of Christ. Uh -huh. yeah. Our Lord and Savior. Yes. Who owned the cattle on a thousand oh. hills. Mm -hmm. Come on. And Thomas said, answered and said unto him, My Lord, my God. Jesus said to him, Thomas, because thou hast seen me, thou hast believed. Mm -hmm. But then there's a colon right there. Mm -hmm. Then he said, Blessed are they that have not seen yeah. and still believe. Yeah. 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 Come on, somebody. Yeah. 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 Because you're being raised up in your way. That's enough to lift you up out of your mortal yeah. shit. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Because of who he is. Yeah. We can face tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Yeah. You might have some burdens in your life today. Uh -huh. But because he lives, you can move them obstacles on out of your way. Uh -huh. Amen. You can go and let somebody know. Uh, for God, I live. And for God, I die. Uh -huh. Come on, somebody. Uh -huh. You can let them know that your trouble won't last always. Uh, because he said, weeping may endure for a night. Uh, but your coming is morning. Uh, have you got to your way or something? Uh, come on, somebody. He lives. Christ Jesus lives today. Don't need a, a whole lot of people to know he walks with you. Young people, he walks with you. He talks to you. Amen. He tells you, you are his own. Don't let nobody tell you ain't nothing. Come on. Come on. Come on. But I am a child of the king. That makes me belong to Roy. Okay. Yeah. I can boast yeah. off of him. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Yeah. And because of him, yeah. mm -hmm. and because of the encounter I had yeah. with him, yeah. right, praise now. God, and because of the encounter that you had yeah. with him, we're going to go up one day. Amen. Yes. Soon and very soon. Yes. 